All right, let's play Mutazion. I actually played this game a couple of years ago and I just remember really enjoying the whole kind of cozy atmospheric vibe. So we're gonna play it again. Gaia, call me when you get there, okay? Mom, dot, dot, dot. Look, you've got to allow me to worry. It's part of my job, part of the job, dot, dot, dot. I'm so proud of you. Stay away from the kitchen, okay? I want to come back to a nice, not burned down house. I have all those frozen meals you made. They're labeled by day of the week. Huh, when did you get so grown up? I love you. Love you too, mom. I just love the art style. It's so cool. I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing anything. There we go. Dearest Gaia and Kai, it's time. You cannot allow this rift between you to linger. He's dying. A terrible thing to do alone. Please come. Much love. Mori. Graubert. <laughs> What's that you've got there? Just a letter. This ink will wear out if you keep reading it so much. The sea ain't a place for letters, girly. That's not actually how letters work. It's a place for adventures, and you're about to have one of the rarest of them all. Full of mutants and monsters and terrible things, ha. Huh. Nice try, but you don't scare me. Moon Dragon was years ago. Mutazion has been safe for ages. Sure, that's what they like to say on the mainland. But why do they all keep away, hmm? You're the first outsider to visit in nigh on 20 years. Hmm. You need a nickname. Something to make you seem nice and friendly to the natives. Ugh. Hmm. I don't like nicknames. Sea crumb. Nice and cutesy. Change the subject. The sea is very relaxing. I might, you know, head out on deck and listen to it for a while. Suit yourself, sea crumb. Might turn out the background noise just a little bit. Hopefully that doesn't end up too loud. <clears throat> okay, that is loud. Not me forgetting to push buttons over and over again. Oh my gosh. Okay. I will push the buttons. Hmm. So pretty.
Okay, still on the boat. It kind of reminds me a little bit of Night in the Woods. Some of the cargo smells weird with just looking around and eyeballing things, but I feel like there was more to do in this game, like more goals. Somehow I expected him to snore. Well, this expired a decade ago. Locked. Okay. Oh. Whoa, you. You know me, you're not real. I must be dreaming. The salt of the air, the sting of the breeze, you know these things, you know me. You look so real. The cat, my cat harassment has begun. There we go. You can lay down. Lay down. You looked so real. Hurry. Wake up, Kai. You need to hurry. Wake up. Oh, bad dreams, sea crumb? No eye. Full of monsters and mutants, I bet. You can just see the cat ears. It's in the waters. Sure. What's that? Can't hear you over the song of the sea? Hi. Nothing. So looking forward to meeting your grandpa? What's he like? Not so lively these days but way back when he was a fearsome man, especially stern about a bit of harmless smuggling. Aha, go out on deck now and you'll see her as we approach. Land ho. No, okay, good. Mutazion. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, <laughs> not me, not pushing buttons again. Tongue. Oh no, I didn't see you. I'm so clumsy, sorry. Stay quiet. I feel like she's a brooding teenager. Sorry. Okay, maybe not. Offer help. No worries, want some help? Thanks, but I'm fine. These are probably too heavy for you. Stay quiet. Anyway, sorry. I'm just a big green lump, always getting in the way. You can say that again. Stay quiet. Um, so you're Kai, right? I feel like I should give them voices, but I'm not gonna remember which voices I do. Yeah, you. Oh, I'm Tong. Um, Claire's son. I think our moms were friends. So you're Mori's grandson, right? Yeah. You should come to the bar later. People hang out there and, ahem. Ah. Uh, come on back to work, my lad. Sorry, but I've got to get on with this. Maury's in the square. She's expecting you. Oh. <laughs> mm oh, I'm sorry, dear. These arms are stronger than they look. 
I'm just as happy to meet you. Just so happy to meet you. I'm Mori, an old friend of your grandpa. Um, nice to meet you. But enough of me. Are you ready? I think so. I'll take you to him. Grandpa. Grandpa? Check for a heartbeat. Oh. It's still ticking away, don't you worry. I didn't mean to wake you. Oh, grandpa voice. I don't know if I can do a grandpa voice. I thought you'd never make it in time. Explain. I came as quick as I could. <laughs> of course. Dot, dot, dot. For heaven's sake. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. My grandpa sounds evil. <laughs> Too late now. I have wanted to meet you for so long. Yet, here you are. And all I can do is lie here, useless. It'd be funny. You couldn't even put up a welcome to Mutazion banner? Ha! Hmm. Well, that's some Dora in you, to be sure. Grandma? Let us not talk of the past. But what a joy it is that you have come to me. Help me. You'll be responsible. Let me know anything I can do, okay? You must tell me about yourself. Talk about family. Um, well, you know, I'm just normal, really. I go to school, which is a bit boring. I do a lot of sport. That's cool. And I spend the rest of the time mopping up after Toby and cooking for Gaia struggles to cook. Joke about how mom is always busy. She's a high-powered architect. Cooking is beneath her. I see. And now I have the pleasure of your company. I guess grandpa's just an old pirate. I bet you've heard a lot about this place. Mom used to tell me bedtime stories about all the weird animals and stuff. Playing with the local wildlife was a favorite pastime of Gaia's. She was very young when she... <laughs> oh. Grandpa? Can I get you something? Water or... I'm not having a good day. Forgive me, I need to rest. But please go and find my old friend Yoke in the archive. He has something for you. Can you do that? If you're sure. I'll write it in my journal. I use it to keep track of tasks and chores and stuff. I am sure. It is very important. You are very important. Grandpa? Z. Okay. Z. Seems like it was used recently. Maybe Mori warmed something up for him. Looks so well worn, it probably only fits Grandpa now. I guess this is the bed Mori made up for me. Okie dokie. How do we go out? Trapped? Okay. Chapter 1 Arrival. Oh, I just love the art style so much. Stairs temporarily closed for repair. Do not use them. Dennis. Can we go up here? Nothing? Okay. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot about these guys. It's all about consumer demand. Pratsky, not this again. Right now, the crossing is always two days a week, right? Salsico, Salsicchio. I'm scared of the sea, full of monsters and things. But if we could develop a single user vehicle, one time I heard Spike saw a mermaid. People could go wherever they wanted. Just imagine all those teeth and claws. What? I said, just imagine all those teeth and claws. Dot, dot, dot. Have you ever seen a mermaid, Sal? <laughs> no, because I'm smart enough to stay away from the sea. Okay. I like this place, but it does all look like it's about to fall apart. Back in a few minutes, Aelin. Probably gonna butcher everyone's names. Mm -hmm. Dot Shaman. Nick tick, nick tick do. I'm sorry, I'll get out of your way. More dots. They're so cute. How do I talk to you? Oh, mom told me about you. Dots, right? Nip, nat, nip. <laughs> nip, nip. Nip, nip, gick, nip, nip, jip. Okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to make you lose count. Nick jibib tiku nick. All right. This route is huge. I wonder how deep it all goes. I I forgot where I'm going. I'm just gonna talk to everybody. Bibbidi boo, bibbidi boo. Oh. Are you here to hear my fish cake song? It's very famous. Fish cake? Bopak's famous fish cake song. Guaranteed to make all the fishies swim, swim, su swim, swim up and say hello. I am glad you like my song. Spike does not. Spike went into the bar over there to get away from my damned nuisance. Well, I like it a lot. You can be my friend as well as Spike. The song catches friends as well. Wonder if mom and grandma ever sat here and looked out to sea. Oh, I keep forgetting to give people voices. Well now, how's it going, Jitterbug? Kai, right? We'll be honest. Is there anyone who doesn't know I'm arriving today? Oh ho, all the locals bending your ear, are they? Spike, you're not helping. Well now, we can hold them if you want. Mui here is a specialist in quiet. That's how she brings in all the prime meat. Hunting. Talk to Mui. Mew? Mui? You hunt? Cool. Sure. Mew is our resident hunter and punk rocker. Spike. Oh, you're going to tell me it's not punk rock, it's sludge core or something? Spike. Dot, dot, dot. Whenever I hear people talk about music genres, I feel like an idiot. You and me both. But hey, Jitterbug. You let me know if you need anything, okay? If you can't tell from my manner of speaking, I was an out-of-towner just like you. I was 20 years, it was 20 years ago I landed on these peculiar shores, and I still sometimes feel like a newcomer. It can be a might overwhelming, but we're all friendly folk. How did I know to give him an accent? I don't know. 
Yes, I think you'll get along mighty fine here. Mighty fine. Have you met all the other folks yet? Oops, wrong voice. Claire's been hankering to see you since we heard you were coming. She's a fine woman, mine like a razor. She keeps my stock count for me. Fastest math in the West. Yep, sure, real good at counting. Hush, kitten. Don't make me regret fostering you. Honestly, the number of times he's threatened to unadopt me. Ha, huh, well then don't give me cause for it. Seems like there's a lot going on. Can we go up here? No. Oh. Oh, okay. Two doors. Black eyeball. Giant bug head. Sure, why not? Oh, uh, missed one. We'll, we'll look at that on the way back. Claire. Oh my goodness! You look just like her. Claire, right? Yeah, I'm definitely going to forget what voices I'm doing. Yes, it's Claire. Mom talks a lot about you. About you a lot. I don't mean to. Oh gosh, I feel so silly. I don't know why I'm crying. I'm so happy to meet you. We'll be honest. Oh man, sorry. I'm not so good with crying. Sorry. It's just, it was such a sweet, wonderful time. Seeing you walk up to me after all those years, it just suddenly brought it all back. And now I can't stop. But please, just leave me for a bit. Go and find Aelin in the square. She's lovely. She'll be on her break about now. I'll come back later, sure. The thank you. Oh wait, another speech bubble. Come back later. Okie dokie. Bird, burb burb. Let's go. <laughs> Lullaby, funny name for a boat. Very cute. Hi guys. Come on, heave ho. Uh, sorry Kai, I have to finish up here. Darn right you do. Come find me this afternoon in the yard behind that building there. I'll be working on my... If you want those supplies I fetched you, you've got to earn them. Um, later. Chicken? Oh. It's over here. Weird stuff, weird seeing stuff from before the meteor. Was this a highway? Okay, so I think, guess Moonflower was the meteor that hit. Mm. Weird, this is half buried. wonder who lives here. Okay, so I think we have to go back there later to talk to Tung, so we'll save that. We'll go find Aelin. Mm -hmm. oh, this way, I think. Moorish, I guess like Moorish, but with Mori. Nice pun. Oh no, I already forgot what name I gave her. Kai, my love. You're, you caught me in my natural habitat. I'm usually here cooking up something yummy. 
If I'm not tending to the garden where I grow all the veggies. It's a bit late for lunch now, but come back if you fancy a bite tomorrow. Should I take anything for Grandpa? Oh no, don't you worry about that. I keep him well supplied. Oh, but I've got so much washing up after all that. A simple stir fry tomorrow, I think. Have you had a chance to get to know our tongue yet? Tall green guy, loads boxes. Oh, and Claire is dying to say hello. She's in the harbor with her shop. Yes, we've met Claire. You're the spit of Gaia, you know. Of course, I'm only going on photos. Your mother was whisked away from us so young. Oh, I'll change the subject. Thanks for helping us reconnect. Well now, I can't stand to see a family torn apart. Whatever reasons Dora had for leaving so suddenly. But you're here now. Time to look to the future, not the past. So I guess the grandma left the grandpa and took the daughters. The one daughter. Looks like they need a bit of water. Cool little garden. Looks like you get to it through the back of the stir fry. I think this is a little. Here you are. Oh my days. Kai, honey, welcome. It's so lovely to see a fresh face around here. Welcome to one of the most beautiful places on earth. Well, I think so anyway. It's nice. It's a totally nice. I suppose it must seem a little backward to you coming from the big city. But just you wait, the dawns and the wildlife. It's bliss. Oh, sorry, how rude. I'm Aelin, and this little one doesn't have a name yet. Pregnant. It's half me and half grobby, so who knows what to expect. The guy who sails the ferry? You don't sound impressed. He's not much of a listener. But he's very caring when you get past that. Oh, before I forget, you must go and see Claire. She was your mother's best friend and she's dying to meet you. Explain about the crying. I think I might have upset her. Oh no, I bet she cried. She was so worried she would. It's nothing personal. Or actually, it's because she loved your mom so much. She'll be all right in a bit. Dot, dot, dot. You might not feel like it yet, but you're coming back to some family history here. It's in a good way, I hope. More. This is my salon, by the way or bathhouse, salon scares away some of my older gentlemen. Not that they say so, say no to a nice manicure though. I do all claws and nails, Yoke swears by my pedicure. Spike loves a mustache wax, I help mew, mewy, mew? I'm gonna go with mew, with matted fur. And Dennis is always in need of a massage. The tension in that man. Anyhow, I tend to work funny hours at the moment because of the baby, so if you miss me, pop in again later. It's so lovely to see a new face. Okie dokie, fingers. Mm. Ah, archive. This is where Yoke works. How do I go in? There's a cool thing in each tiny drawer. Is this an actual monorail? Oh my god, wild. <clears throat> okay, so I guess this will pass our time. Oh no, voice. Could it be? Kai? 
What is this place? Welcome to the archive. A fine collection of objects and writings are hidden herein. Including my writing, some very important research, if I may say so myself. Research. Certainly, investigating the history of here and hereabouts. For years it has been my aim to collect everything I can. Archives are vital places to record culture as well as fact. Be earnest. Sounds really important. I'm glad you think so. But to purpose! To purpose! I'm supposed to give you this. Damn. Encyclopedia Flora of Mutazion. A book? The encyclopedia contains detailed information about the plant life hereabouts. The flora of Mutazion, starting from seeds. A collaboration between me and your grandfather. Which we are both, ahem, quite proud of. Interesting, thanks. I believe he wishes to cultivate your interest in these things. Do, I, do have a look inside. In the meantime, thank you for paying our humble archive a visit, young lady. Feel free to have a look around and ask me if there's anything you're curious about. Afternoon. Cute. Have you had a chance to look through the encyclopedia yet? I will soon. I promise. Don't look at me like I'm scolding you, dear girl. It's not tardy homework. It's just a fascinating compendium, that's all. The moon dragon incident was terrible for the inhabitants of the area. But out of tragedies, now things grow. Chimeras, new species. That book is a record of much of them. I remember the first time I saw the word chimera, I kept calling it a chimera because I had never heard it. No, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Wish for me to pass it on to you. So do investigate it if you get the chance. More. Do come and see me if you have any more questions. Okie dokie. The piano. It's over here. Good day to you, friendly mannequin. That's kind of creepy. Oh. Always important to wear your scuba goggles, just in case. There's some wildly retro stuff here. Near to new. Plant? Ooh, seeds. Oh, yeah, I think I remember you get to, like, grow gardens in this. Picalino seed. Dinosaurs. Cute. What's this? Oh, more seeds? Red tea plant seed. Not a fern spore. Seeds? More seeds? Oh. Huh. All arranged in a circle. Seeds. One temple fern seed. I wonder if you guys can hear my dog snoring in the background right now. I won't know until late. Oh, spider. Cute. Wow, this is incredible. Damn it. Okay. I love her socks and shoes. Oh. Creepy. Oh, it's like a little face. Okay. 
I think I'll save exploring until I know my way around the village better. All right, let's go. Let's go for a long walk back. Look at the flowers. Wait, where'd it come from? This way. Dino. It would be so cool to actually go to a place like this. Three Vogelberry seed. These ruins feel more recent than the others. Here. Seeds? Seeds? No seeds. Okay. I forgot what I'm supposed to be doing again now. Maybe go back to Grandpa. Grandpa! Let's see what voice Grandpa gets this time. Oh. oh, I guess I wonder... Oh, okay. Look at that encyclopedia. Oh, so I should go... Oh, yeah, I'm supposed to go see Tongue and see Claire again. Oh, can I not look at it? Oh, there we go. Thanks to Yoke in particular, many always. Okay, I'm not gonna read that. Alga Fern, Anne Arcadia, Arrow Hat, Astral Ragwort, Atlas Leaf. So I bet I'm supposed to get seeds, blue nanas of every kind, like kind of plant. Koroka, Crescent Reed, Dracania, oh gosh, there's a lot. I'm not going to read all of these. No mushroom. Do, 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 do. Oh my gosh, so many. Oh, pink, pink puffetry. Cute. <laughs> Got that, rosary, shaggy beard, silver cup. Beach. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, so many. Okay, we're on W. Witch bullet. Wujin leaf. River eggs. Okay, the end. Let's, let's get back to Grandpa. Maybe I wasn't supposed to come to Grandpa yet. So. I should let him sleep. Okay, not Grandpa yet. Weird herbs and things for cooking. I am going to be running back and forth so many times because I have a really bad memory in like bad directions. Two gelosa seeds. So I'm just going to instantly forget where I'm going every time. Cute male guy. Going to Tongue. I remember that. Tongue and Claire. Oops, I forgot to look at that again. Someday. I think it'll stay there. Kai, thanks so much. Oh wait. Kai, thanks for so much for coming back. I'm okay now. It was a bit much, that's all. But I just wanted to say you're so welcome. Thanks. Let me show you my shop. I've got all kinds of things here. Fruit, vegetables, meat, fabric, furniture, pearls, cutlery. I don't have any money. Oh, I didn't bring any money with me though. We trade in goods, not money. Love that. Everyone puts things in and everyone takes them out. It's more of a central store, I guess. But you won't need anything while you're here. Everyone will be queuing up to give you what you need. Is it really so rare to have visitors? The last visitor we had was Spike. 
Oh, well, maybe Grobert. But he comes and goes so much. Spike arrived here when I was a teenager. He was such a mysterious stranger. He runs the bar over there now. Uh, anyway. Cool, so the shop is for trade. Really, it's just a way to pool our resources, and I keep the inventory. I'm very good at maths. Speaking of which, can you do me a favor and go tell Jella their order is in? Je Jelle? I've got some potash. Potash? Potash? Where should I go? Head down deep into the cave. Jelle lives right at the bottom. Oh, we get to go in the cave. There, our resident chemist. I don't, I don't know how to say that. Potash? The potash is for soap, you see. Don't be scared by their appearance. Jelle is completely lovely. Yoke tried to explain it to me once. I think they came from a different process than, like, humanoid mutations. But anyway. Okay, sure. Sure. Oh, more. I'm very envious, by the way. You inherited Gaia's long legs. The help me swim fast. She was always so graceful and could run like the wind. I've always been so stubby. Oh, but I used to love running after her. Shame I couldn't run all the way to the mainland. I thought you didn't like adventures. Oh, no, I mean, my family's here. People I love are here. It's just hard not to dream of more sometimes. But, well, the truth is I'm afraid of the sea. My shop's on a boat, but it's always moored. Everyone I love seems to... Everyone I love seems to love the adventure, but it just scares me. It's humiliating, really. Let's encourage her. Don't feel bad. Everyone has something that bothers them. Thanks. I haven't actually told many people that. Don't tell anyone, okay? Anyway, I should get on. Thanks for listening. You just said I should get on. There's more to say. Thanks for taking my message. Okay. Let's go do tongue. Tongue tongue. Tongue then then jelly. Oh, look at the dots up there. This thing has seen better days. Oh, um, hey. You're not going to throw that sanding thingy at me, are you? Uh, are you kidding or are you actually annoyed? Kidding. Dot, dot, dot. Maybe it was weird to ask. I'm just pretty terrible at reading people, I guess. Sorry, start over. Oh, okay, sure. So, um, this is my boat. Be positive. Looks very boaty. I figure I could do with a ticket to freedom. It's nice here, in theory, but it's also just jungle and family. Talk about escape. You gotta find places to make your own, right? Yes, exactly that. So, you were brought up by your mom? Be honest. Not always. I mean, I've had to bring myself up a bit. It's just me, my little brother Toby, and her now. But it's only been like that for a couple of years. What happened to your... Stay quiet. Dot dot dot. Right, sorry, none of my business. This boat was my dad's. He had a proper boat too, that's what he left on. He used to call this his little runabout. Well, it's yours now. Yeah. It's mine now. Time to work out what I want it to be. Get it? Oh, what? Oh, sorry. I need to concentrate. 
This bit is quite complicated. Sand, sand. Okie dokie, are there seeds back here? Seeds? Seeds? Nope, can't go back there. That guy? Seeds? No. Is that a seed? Is that a seed? No. Wild grass seed. Oh, I could go this way. Oh, I was just leaving. Okay, we'll go this way so I can finally read that thing I skipped over multiple times. Where was it? Right here. This way to boat. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Can we talk to you again, buddy? I don't think I gave him a name. Shh. I need to conduct a sea controlled experiment. I think that the fish cake song makes the fishes come. But I can't know until I try a quiet fishing. That sounds very smart. It's not very int interesting. I might play arcade instead. Come to the bar later. I'll show you arcade. Sounds fun. Shush. Oh, seed. Oh, Jalosa seed. Oh, seed. Giant tree ferns. Tree fern spore. And these seeds. Let's go to the cave. Why do I have an urge to hit this big old pipe with a hammer? I would too, Kai. Oh, he's so cute. And the spider. Hello. I don't know, sweet thing. The readings just won't improve. That's why I've not been able to spend so much time with you and your pipe. It's the bedrock of our whole ecosystem. But I'll make it up to you, I promise. I'll bring you some nice crispy blue bugs as a treat. How about that? Sweet thing. Please talk to me. There's a sweet thing in a pipe. Okie dokie. Whoa, these roots go on forever. Cute. Midi mid Midisti. I'm just saying. Pratsky, you're always just saying. There's a market opportunity out there. Wiener, the metrics are dire. Worst, wiener worst. Perhaps we need a new productivity matrix. Hi, I'm Kai. Maybe we need to update our metrics? Salsicchio, what's a market opportunity? A gap in the market. Market. Is that manure you're shoveling? Grob's currently got a monopoly on ferry crossings, but he doesn't have to. That's a market opportunity. It would be. It is, if we actually lived in a market economy. That settles it. Let's reformat both the matrix and the metrics. I guess you don't want to talk to me. Fine. over here first. I think I, I think it'll be seeds. Seeds. Yes. Lumen hat spore. Oh. oh. Big enough to crawl through, but way too filthy to try. Oh. This doorway feels weirdly organic. Whoa, check out this purple crystal. Mm -hmm. Hello, passing some time. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> Jelly, sound generation biological outcome. Oh, didn't do a voice. Arg, yes, I am rather impressive although less than optimal at the present time. 
less than optimal. I have to acquire my nutrients from the earth. I must spend part of each day recharging as you might when you sleep or eat. However, for some time, the quality of the soil in our biome has been degrading. Offer help. Can I help? I need means of supplementing my nutrition. Hold on. Supplements. I do not fully ascertain your meaning. Explain. My mom always makes me carry vitamin pills. She says with all the sport I do, I need extra stuff. It sounds like what you need. Minus one vitamin pill. Intriguing. It seems parental care includes the supplementation of organic compounds required for normal growth and nutrition. Gratitude. You're welcome, Jelly. Oh, and Claire has some um, potash for you. I was supposed to tell you. Understood. I will now assimilate these resources. Evening. Cute, cute, cute. Seeds? No seeds. Hmm? Oh, you can hear me. Human named Kai. Ask what they're doing. What are you up to? In the community named Mutazion, my role is many and varied. Some of what I do includes basic chemistry in order to produce cosmetics and cleaning substances. I do not need cleaning products myself. I simply process dirt at a microscopic level to produce a nutritious ferment. What else do you do? I also work with humanoid named Dennis to monitor the health of the mutazion biome. Biome? All of Mutazion is linked by the roots of the great Papu tree. Papu. The flora and fauna depend upon the health of the tree and its symbiotic relationship with other organisms. For the past few years, it has been in decline. So humanoid named Dennis and I monitor the health of the biome. Cool. I will continue my work now. But yet there's more to say. I must commit 100% of my attention to my work. Okie dokie, baby. Okay, so it's evening now. It's going to take a while for the data to be sufficient. Understood. I was thinking something like a bicycle for water. A bicycle. Yeah, do you remember Spike had one we crashed into the river? Famously buoyant, then. With a few modifications, they can be. Such as. First things first, Pratsky. What matters is the branding. The pedal ho. From like when Grob says land ho. Pedal ho. Right. Well, Midisty, I look forward to the maiden voyage. I hope it has good mermaid protection. <laughs> Vicious mermaids. Nothing, nothing. Okay, so I know they said to go by the bar in the evening. Maybe we should go do that. Oh, the lights are so cute. Look, our little seed crumb has graced us with her presence. I don't remember what name voice I did for him. Honey, indoor voice, please. Always the sea. What's that, little man? If I spoke like you, I'd call everyone my little ventilation unit. To be fair to Grob, the sea is a bit more picturesque than plumbing. Waste disposal and infrastructure management. 
You need to loosen anchor a bit, matey. You see the sea again, always the sea. You need the sea, matey. It brings you all them weird thingamabobs for fixing things and stuff. Shh. Someone get me another turn. <laughs> More? More? Oh my gosh, his arm hair. A drain cleaner, eight stainless steel pipes, a submersible water pump with tethered float, and an electro... Just write me a list, matey. Honey, indoor voice. Ailen, baby, loosen up. Challenge the subject. Um, Bopec seems pretty into that game. Who's speaking? Oh, he loves it. Ailen here is our reigning champion, though. Hush. Why do I still not have any rum? You got some right there in your mug, buddy. Bopec. Forgot Bopec's voice. Having fun? No, this is important. Must c concentrate. Okay, don't you? Bopec. Mm, maybe. Uh, trapped. Trapped. What just happened? Oh, I'm excited. Okay. Maybe we can go see Grandpapa. Mm -mm. Or maybe Mori again. Get some food. Oh, all of them. She was looking really, what's the word? Love sick. Maybe it's the hormones. I remember when I was pregnant with you, I... Mom! Oh, she's her daughter too. I know it's none of my business. But oh my goodness, of all people, him? She loves him. Love doesn't protect you. I mean, just think about what happened to you. Oh. Who's speaking right now? Tongue, how's your boat project coming? All I'm saying is that you have to consider what kind of father your child is going to have. Oh my goodness, these voices. Was she really looking, um, lovesick? Let's join in. Who was looking lovesick? No one! Mom is just gossiping! Kai, dear. Maybe she's having second thoughts. All okay with Nono? Oh, so Nono's grandpa. I'm letting him rest. I'll take him up some soup in a bit. Well, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seeds, seeds. Well, okay. To grandpa. Cute lights. Thank you. Oops. Oh no. Oops. Oops. Grandpa. Okay. You were in my dream. You were out east by the temple. And the great bird picked you up and carried you away. I tried to shout, but you were climbed up into its wings. And you flew it back down to safety. Dot, dot, dot. I first met Manny at the temple. I learned so much there. Who's Manny? One of those dreams that is so vivid you can feel the starlight on your skin. I'm dying, Kai. Don't say that. I know you know this theoretically, but you need to understand it actually. But I'm going to help. But, I know, I know. I didn't ask for you to watch me die. But it is happening. It is something I have come to Except, you must too. That way we'll not waste time. 
So why am I here? I want to get to know you. And I also want you to get to know the people who are part of me. <laughs> to know them is also to know me. Talk about the future. Okay. So, okay. You're dying. So what? We can still have a good time. I'll do what you say. When you're tired, I'll explore and meet people. And I'll hang out when you feel up to it. Dot, dot, dot. Deal. Deal. I feel privileged to have you for company on my last great adventure. What's next? That dream. I wonder if you could go to the temple and see if there are any flowers you could bring back for me. I miss the outdoors. All right, temple in the middle of the night, let's do it. Not intimidating at all. Go, 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 Wait, can I go in here now? Hello, hello? Nope, okay. Oh, seeds, seeds. Seeds, silver laurel. I'm gonna have so many seeds. That sounds kind of gross. To the temple. Go, go, go. No, 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 cat. Cat. Mm. Oh, come on. There you go. This must be the way to the temple. Sorry for the brief cat interlude. Hi. You're almost in the camera. Almost. Pick your head up there. There's a kind of shrine through here. I know, we already went here. Do not eat my cords. <gasps> I've been waiting for you, Kai. Arg! You and I, who know each other quite well. You're not real. You know me. We've met many times, you know this. I'm seeing things. It's the stress, all this new stuff, and Grandpa, I'm seeing things. You are seeing only what is here. In this place, the spaces between the worlds are of a finer grain. Don't let what you think you should be blind what you think should be blind you to what it oh don't let what you think should be blind you to what is. We need a comma in there. You know me. Deny, deny, deny. I don't. We are old friends. You will make me prove it to you. So be it. I recall a heavy day just on the edge of autumn. Walking home from school. There was a gust of wind that felt blown from another continent. You saw, born upon it, a wisp flower seed which floated to earth like a snowflake. You caught it, saw its strange shimmer. You planted it in the little dirt pile by your window and it grew into a plant that you swore, sang a song just for you. No one else heard it. True, Kai? True? Yes, true, good. Now listen. The old man is dying. His pride has poisoned him. But there is a solution. Dressania leaves. It is the only chance he has to hold on. Stay quiet. You will find the wide leaf of Dressania next to the temple garden. Why can't you get it for him? Dot dot dot. Seven Gardens mood is sung. Papu flowers for the fung. You see? What? That barely makes sense. Not everything can be easy. 
Use your brain, your ears, your eyes, and hands. Now the Dressania leaves. Take them to him, Kai. Go. Okay, so they're in the temple? I forgot what he said. Oh no. Leaves somewhere. Outside the temple? By the temple? Temple leaves? Uh, did I already pick up the leaves? Oh no. Leaves? Oh, uh, leaves? Be leaves. Oh, sweet. Yes. And seeds. Okay. Let's bring those leaves. Leaves to Grandpa. Go, go, go. Run, 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 run. Grandpa leaves. Cute. Oh, this thing goes a bit faster. Maybe. I'm coming very slowly, Grandpa. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm still feeling weak. I got leaves for you, Grandpa. Kai, do you know what this is? Promise me you didn't eat any of this. Promise me. <gasps> Did he try to poison Grandpa? Of course I didn't. They're leaves. Forgive me. This is an extraordinarily dangerous substance if ingested. What are you doing? They're also potentially life-saving substance. Did I just kill you? I was dying anyway. Dressania is a drastic option. One I was too weak to trust in. Until you showed me what I needed to do. I need to... Grandpa! Grandpa, don't die! Zzz. Okay, not dead. This is even more stressful than looking after a toddler. Night. I must sleep for this to, to work. We will speak more in the morning. Is it bedtime? Bed. Didn't realize how tired I was until just now. Can I, can I lay down? Can I do it? How do I go to bed? What's happening? Do, do I not go to bed? Okay. No sleep for me. Oh, the light's on up here. What can go in? Oh! <gasps> Oh my gosh, so cute. I love this one. Oh, do you like screamy vocals? Screaming is just like any instrument. Once you understand how to listen to it, it becomes beautiful. She sounds really free. I think that's the point. Sometimes you just need to burn up and float away like a piece of ash from a fire. Not quite nighttime music though. I'll turn it off soon. This is how I prepare for hunting. Makes the silence of the swamp sound deafening. Cool, cool, cool. I like your little space. Very nice. Oh, oh there was a eyeball. Go back into the ruckus. You see eyeball? Eyeball. 
surprisingly romantic pics. <laughs> It's not bedtime. Oh. Eyeball? Eyeball? Oh my gosh, give them back. Wow, I didn't notice these until now. I love them. They're very cute. Eyeball? Less pretty than the stained glass window. I guess you have to maybe do everything before you're allowed to go to sleep. I don't think I go back down here. Maybe I do. Yeah. Looks like, oh, okay, you go, you go. I don't know why you let him talk to you like that. I can't explain. Try me. Dot, dot, dot. If I were him, I'd give you everything you wanted. Tongue, this isn't a movie. I don't want to be saved. Ooh, intrigue. I don't get it. Mm, what you what you two doing? <laughs> you drunk? Well, that did it. She'll see my side of things tomorrow. I'm not so sure, Pally. She told you pretty straight. She just doesn't know what's out there. Come on, you gotta listen to her. The burbs ain't her place. She got her bathhouse too. She likes that work. She can work in the bathhouse in the city. Ooh. A wonderful new life, full of adventure and grub. She got to want more than this. All right now, maybe you've had enough. Don't wait, want any more anyway. Glug, 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 glug. <laughs> Gonna go home, home to my beautiful boat. My sweet old bark. If she loved me, she'd follow me. You work on that definition of love you got there, Pally. Glug, 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 glug. The drama. You got any love woes you want to share with us, Jitterbug? Bet she's got a string of boys, broken hearts, and her bow wave. Enough, Grub. How about you, Spike? Oh, I gave up on love a long time ago. Maybe it gave up on me. Cheery. Quite. Quite, quite. Bopek? No, no, no. 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 Yes. New high score. Now only Aelin has a higher score. Tongue will be here any moment. I don't know if you will. Yeah, I gotta go around him. This way. This way. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I'll see that another time. Bopex waiting for you. Okay. Well, I might figure out how to go to sleep. Oh, wait. You too. Kai, sweetie, I'm closing up right now. Have you been to Spike's bar yet, though? I think my tongue is over there. And there's a phone if you haven't called your mom yet. Thanks, Maury. Okay, so maybe we'll call mom and then we can go to bed. Mommy. Let's talk to mommy. I think that was what I didn't see over here. I have my camera right in front of it, so I can't see. 
Wait, there. There. Oh, okay. Calling mommy. Hello? Mom? Darling, it's so good to hear you. How was the trip over? The captain was a bit weird, but it was fine. Is he nearby? Is that why you're whispering? Are you getting to know people? People have been nice. Are you sure? Talk about Grandpa. Everybody's been really nice. And Grandpa is. I guess it's a bit, um, scary. Don't be afraid to ask for help, sweetie. I'm sorry I can't be there. It's just... Stop it. Ugh, Toby's eating toothpaste again. No, give it here. Do you remember Yoke? Of course. I mean, it was a long time ago, but... He gave me this really beautiful encyclopedia. Wow, Yoke was always so precious about his books. That's a real honor. What's it like? It's full of loads of info about local, um, plant stuff. Plants and stuff. I'm sure Grandpa will tell you more about it all when he feels better. Are you feeling okay otherwise, though? Talk about my fears. What if he dies? Oh, honey. Grandpa No-No is very ill. And sometimes, sometimes we can't help people get better. But whatever happens, we can be there with them. Be with them. Just make sure you look after yourself as well, okay? Maybe even have a little fun? Yeah, okay. I wish you could have come with me. Oh, love. I know. I just... It's complicated. Nana was so angry at him. I'm not ready yet. But I know everyone there will take wonderful care of you. But... Toby, no! Ugh, crayons on the wall. Sorry, honey, I have to go, but call like we said, okay? Thursday and Sunday evening. Love you. Okay, love you. Speak soon. Bye, mommy. Oh, late night, okay. Here we go. Well now, that was a bit of an evening. Best get home now, though, out of the rain. Soon as you're under Papu's canopy, you'll be okay. Thank you. I like Spike. Oh, run, run, run! Home, home. Now, now I think we can go to bed. <laughs> Have a long day. Go, go, go. Wait, what can I see? My ball? I'm exhausted. Time for bed. Now, we slip. Oh, pants off. Okay. Well, I think we'll end it here and we'll do this next day in another video. It's time to wake the cat up. Wake her up. Wait, get over there. Please like and subscribe. Bye.